Hi, this is Kerry again from freeaudacitytutorials.com. This is advanced tutorial number one. I'm going to start showing you some effects, which you can find in the effects menu right up here, third from the right. Um, what I have here is this is a vocal track, just some speaking of my daughter for a podcast that we do. So take a listen. Hi, welcome to the Christian Home and Family Podcast with Kerry Green. He's my dad. Okay. So you hear about the volume level on that. The first thing we're going to look at is the amplify effect. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to select a section here where the audio is a little lower. I'm going to go up here to effect and choose amplify. Now you notice it automatically fills in these windows based on the selection that you made. Now 0.0, .0 is the highest you want to go because if you get above that, it's going to start to distort the audio. And so if you need to amplify, but it's already at 0.0, .0 you're going to have to change this amplification in decibels to a lower number. So I'm going to choose 2.0, and you notice it changes my new peak amplitude where I can raise it some more, okay? So what I'm going to do is raise it, and I can hit preview to listen to it afterward. Welcome to the Christian Home and Family Podcast with Kerry Green. So that increased the volume a little bit. Now, if I, if I like that, if I'm happy with that, I can hit OK and watch what happens to the sound wave right up here. Okay, you see how the sound wave itself actually grew. Now I'm going to do Control Z to undo that, and I want to show you what happens if you actually allow that thing to clip. So I'm going to leave it like this. I'm going to click the Allow Clipping button, and I'm going to move it above zero and let you listen to that. Welcome to the Christian Home and Family Podcast with Carrie Green. Now because I didn't raise it a tremendous amount, it's hard to hear the clipping, but let me raise it on up so you can hear. Welcome to the Christian Home and Family Podcast with yeah, that's even painful if you got headphones in, so I'm sorry about that. But that's, uh, that's what the Amplify tool does. Now, honestly, I don't use the Amplify tool very much because I would much rather use the Envelope tool up here, which I showed in one of the earlier tutorials. I believe it was the Intermediate Tutorial number one. Now, another uh, thing that I'm going to show you is called Fade In. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to move down here to an instrumental track. So I'm going to mute this one, and I'm going to unmute this one. And this is an instrumental track by my friend Adam Ray. It's a song called uh, Hello, Joe. Uh, kind of a tribute to Joe Satriani. If you like Joe Satriani, you're going to like this piece. You can find Adam's music at heyrayguitar.com. You can see it there at the bottom of the screen. All right, I'm going to play the track so you can hear what it sounds like. Okay, so you get the idea. Now, if I'm going to use the Fade In tool, it's a thing where it starts quiet and gets louder. So I'm going to start here at the beginning of the track and drag across a certain portion of it, go up to Effect, and go to Fade In. And it is going to automatically fade that at the rate uh, that is right for the, the amount of track that I selected. So you see how it made that smaller. Now let's listen to it. Okay, until it's up to the normal volume. Uh, this is very effective for certain things. Uh, you'll find all kinds of uses for it. Now I'm going to hit Control Z to undo that. And now we're going to scroll over to the end of this track. And I am going to show you the Fade Out tool. Okay, so I'm going to play a little bit of the... Okay, that's the ending of the song. I'm going to select a section of the song again. And I'm going to go to Effect. I'm going to choose Fade Out. And watch what happens to the sound wave. You see how it fades. And so I'm going to play this. Right here. So you see how it faded out. That's exactly what the tool is supposed to do. Um, I use this on my podcast when my music needs to be fading out into a, a section of talking. Now I'm going to do the Control z again and undo that again. Check me out at freeaudacitytutorials.com where I provide podcast cover art and website headers at a very reasonable price. And I also provide podcast consulting. You can check out what I've got to offer there. Thanks for watching.